Davis with you, bringing you and we are playing Texas Tech at home. That should be pretty good. Innovation that we're both three and three in conference play. So. We're in Morgantown, West Virginia, to witness this exciting matchup. Of course, there's no wind. Let's see how wonderful they are. see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Three down, three down. I got one, I got one. Oh, they got... And they get nice yardage on that run. West Virginia is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. Record-breaking performance a week ago, that's great, but they got to put that in the rearview mirror and get back to work today. So it's second yep. down now, and they need about four yards to pick this. up the first. Did not, did not pay Oh, that kills me. We just gave that right to Texas Tech. Not only did he demonstrate his leaping ability, but he also... Great job. Here comes the offense, and you've got to wonder if that last interception's weighing on the quarterback's mind at all. And I don't think this defense will lay down lightly. They're going to try to continue to rattle this guy. And he's taken down right around the 34. Just a simple draw play there, but they picked up some big yards. Just need to start paying attention more. That's all we got to do. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. They'll bring him down. The 37. So on first down, they go to the air and pick up huge yardage. Well, that was just a well executed play. They picked a perfect time to stretch the defense with a passing play, and it worked. No, nope, we're going to get just smashed. They have the runs coming. Tackle made at the 22 yard Okay. Line, and that's their third first down of the drive. The defense needs to figure out a way to stop them, or else they're going to have no problem putting points on the board. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. He makes it out to maybe the 20-yard line. A two-yard run by the halfback. This linebacker's had a couple years of experience, and he's really solidified himself as a reliable tackler, as you can see from that last stop. Yeah, although we're going with the, the run play, aren't they? What a play to set him up with a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. And down he goes around the three yard line. You know what? We're we're gonna give the we're gonna give this halfback smash a try. All right, good. I think he deserves more touchdowns. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum. So as we get closer to halftime. I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Passes in and it's picked out of the sky. I don't think he came down on the ground. The quarterback has made some really careless throws, but you got to also give credit to the oh, defense for being able to clean up. Dang it, dang it, dang it. That was a the last time. bad, bad. Should be move. interesting to see what they do this time. One general rule in any game is to hold on to the ball. If you're in the negative in the turnover department, your chances of winning decrease exponentially. Fires it out. He's tackled at the 45-yard line. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it to make it. We just need to get the field goal range. From the 45-yard line. First down. and it's almost picked off. You know, for a safety, this guy has really good hands. I'm very surprised to see him drop an interception like that. Could come back to haunt his team as well. 
I really need this. And he's immediately tackled. The Mountaineers use their second timeout. I think he was going to go to his tight end the whole way, but the defense didn't expect it. Sometimes those big guys can fool defenders into thinking they're blocking. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Ooh, Ooh I all hit the wrong button again. That makes it second and ten. You should not be doing that. Well, that just hurt us. Take their final timeout. You know, the offensive line really let the quarterback down there. They've got to do that a really gets hurt us. Really, the really bad. We could have had a field goal chance. Blitz, but you also have to obviously pick up your defensive lineman. That time, a miscommunication, and the result is a sack. He wants it all. They knock it down, incomplete, and that makes it fourth down. Boy, great defense on that play. They were expecting and they defended it very well by getting a hand in there to break up the play. So it's fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. I guess he'll throw this one as far as he can and hope for a miracle. Oh, oh I thought we were... Uh... Wait, what? Okay, I thought we'd already running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. He's to the 20, gets out to around the 22. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. First and 10, ball on the 22 yard line. Gains his way to the 33 yard line. Now that they're seeing that we're running it, right? That's a gain of one on the play. That makes it second and ten. Second and ten. Ball on their own 34. Strike to his receiver, no good. That was textbook coverage by the defense. That's exactly what you want to do on every single pass play. But it doesn't always happen. Why is it our pass action plays we can't get anything? Reacting to that sack. Not only do they get the quarterback, but they hit him hard. I think that can really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, you got to be thinking he's going to be a little bit gun shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on. He takes it right side for a good game. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. And he's tackled at the 29. I think he died. <laughs> That's three down and one to go. The Red Raiders with a three point lead. Well, this final few minutes is going to determine this one. Tight ball game. Action set to start here in the fourth quarter. Less than three minutes in the game. He's to the 40. He's at midfield. Brought down to the open field. This back might need a breather after that run. But when he comes back, just give it to him again. We needed that big, we needed that big, big run play like that. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. Stop the 37 yard line. Man left, man left. Three down, three down. Mike 13, Mike 13. He's coming, 
They go back to him on a quick throw, and he is drilled at the 36-yard line. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. He's taken down around the 25-yard line. I'm trying not to throw the ball to try not get an interception. Taken down in the backfield. The lineman had a big push there to get in the backfield and bring him down. And once he gets moving, there's no stopping him. This come on, guy is come so on. big and oh, strong that he's almost impossible play. It's just to block with one guy. This is the eighth play of this drive. They go to the run and he's tackled in the backfield for a loss. No game. That brings us third and fourteen. Third down, and they need to get it to the fifteen. A little over a minute in the game. Well, you what in the world? The coordinator side of things, and why not? His defense just came up with one of the biggest stops of the game in a vital spot in this fourth quarter. Virginia is going to use their first time out of the half here. I, I'm going to take the safe route. Let's just try it. Worst case. It's up. And this is oh, no. That's why they... Oh, no. I did not know that was our deal with our kicker. Red Raiders. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 4C. For Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye. I forgot our kicker was that shitty. Yeah, we played one hell of a game, though. Very, very close game. I literally thought our... Yep. Yep. That's, that's all on offensive line. Or all of the offensive coordinator. Yep. Bad loss, but it is what it is. But if you can hit that like and subscribe button, until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day, and bye-bye.